So I'm getting ready to feed my bees. So this is the, the entrance feeder. I'm gonna fill it up again. So I'm gonna add a little bit more sugar water. They've been very, very hungry because they're working very hard to lay down all the new comb for the queen to lay her eggs. So they're, the bees are all around me and as long as you're zen, they're not gonna sting you. So you just have to be careful. Take a look inside of the, the hive. So there they are. They're already building the honeycomb. And this is propolis right here. So this is like the glue that holds it together. And that has antibacterial properties. It's got a lot of minerals, very nutritious. And now we can take one of the high bodies out to inspect. And here they are. They're not happy about me getting in there, but that's the comb. They're preparing the comb and the queen will start laying eggs in that comb. So the workers right now are actually just making comb for the queen to be able to lay her larva down. Now, as long as I don't get, you know, fearful, they're fine. They're squirming around me, but that's, that's what we want right there. I just took this jar off the beehive and I've got three worker bees. I call them my girls because the workers are female and they actually do most of the work. The males are the drones and they basically, their job is to impregnate the queen to lay new larvae. And at the end of the summer, the males are eliminated from the hive. Not sure how they do that, but they're not allowed in the hive and they basically sacrifice them until the spring when they need their male fertility capabilities in the hive.